Yes, hi, CB Radio fans and freaks. It's uh, seven months ago. I'm back here on uh, YouTube. It was a very heavy time, and now I have a little time to make a new video. And this is my new old radio in my collection. Here is a Royce Model 642. A very nice radio here i'm very happy yes um i will start a radio here on channel 40 um we are on usb and you hear you can hear the noise see the s needle here on s7 this is plc power line communications into france here in switzerland we don't have a change for this mistake here. Okay, now I will look here what's up. Um, AM here this morning. We'll see. This is an FM carrier here. And we can't make FM with this radio here. And you can see the strong PLC signal here. No change to make CB here in this area. Also here an FM station with S9 here. Yes, that's a problem here. Power line communication is a very bad thing here. Okay, this is the mic, the original Royce mic here, the CVPA switch, the noise blanker, and we can hear the effect. ANL, Vegas HEC here. The squelch, mode switch. No traffic, LSB, USB, tone, not here, tone, regulation, RF gain, PA, volume, and we have the clarifier, and SWR calibration here. Yes, um, we will change here channel light and Gluck. But that's the problem. This is a 150 volts rig, and here in Switzerland we have 230 volts. And now my radio is running with 12 volts, and with 12 volts, the lock not will go. Yes, that's the problem. We have here the lights, the X lights, and USB and LSB here. Okay, and this radio includes the CCI 3001 board. It's a board in a lot of radios here. I will look here, I will show these radios. This is a Roy 639. This is a Globephone GS480DX. And this is a Sommercamp TS340. And includes all the similar PCB board like this Royce 642. Okay, I have made a little bit picture show and thank you for your visit. Bye bye.